All right, continue with our kettlebell series. This is gonna be a bottoms up half kneeling press. If you have not learned how to do a standard uh, half kneeling kettlebell press, I would recommend starting there first. But once we've got that, we can progress. So your basic position, knee stacked under head, hip stacked under head. My back foot, I like to have flat. That allows me to relax the muscles on the front of my leg so I can get more hip extension so it doesn't kick me in like that. Um, the front leg, I want to make sure that my foot is stacked underneath my knee. I don't want it too far forward and I don't want it back where my heel is disconnected. That's not going to give me a stable base. So I'm going to plant this foot in the ground. Now, with the grip, assist with the other hand. You can just lay it there and then you can find where you want to grip. So I'm going to grip in the thumb side slightly. If you're having trouble with this, you can actually tilt it and grip that whole side and that's going to give you a little bit more stability. Okay. So I'm going to go thumb side slightly. We're going to stack the belt. I want to make sure that my wrist is not breaking here. I want to keep that stacked so that force is transferring through my forearm. My elbow is stacked underneath the pinky and then the thumb is stacked in front of my shoulder. From here, my free side, I'm going to make tension, brace my abs, squeeze my butt cheek, drive over top. Now when I get over top, I don't want my rib cage to come forward, I don't want my hips to drift forward. When I pull down, I can look at it, and then I can re-breathe. I want to try and keep my fist stacked over my elbow. and then park the bell at the top. Now, with this exercise, if you're struggling with it, um, adjust the grip or maybe go down and wait a little bit. Uh, another thing is, if you're really struggling with it and you can't keep the position, we find that when people can't do this, it's typically that you're finding out that they may have an issue with the shoulder or the stability at the shoulder, but a lot of times it can be a mobility limitation. So if I cannot keep a vertical path, a lot of people tend to dump the belt in. That's usually because I don't have adequate external rotation, so that shoulder has to work a lot harder than it should, and I start to dump that uh, weight in. So if you're having trouble with that, maybe work on a little bit of a mo mobility, Maybe don't do this exercise right now. Probably spend more time doing the standard half kneeling kettlebell press. Great exercise, give it a try.